All right, Herc, let's talk about the newcomers because we finally got to see them. Who stood out to you? And do you think that they can actually make the Olympic roster in what, uh, eight, nine months' time? Jeez, it's coming up quick. Yeah, the kids stood out. The kids. I mean, mm -hmm. Mia Fischel, Jaden Shaw, Alyssa Thompson, the kids. Is this what you should have been doing in the lead up to last Olympics or last Olympics? It's preparing for the next Olympics by playing the kids. When you don't play the kids, Seth, guess what happens? You show up to a World Cup with players, mm. some players who are either a little over where they should be and other players who don't have the, the experience necessary to play at that level in a major tournament. They show you that they can help. They show you that they belong. Listen, Alex Morgan is gonna be 35, I believe, heading into next season. She doesn't have the same productivity with the national team that she does at the NWSL mm -hmm. level. I believe in all comps in the last two seasons, NWSL, it's like 27 goals. She, she, she should be respected there. And by all accounts, she should be respected on the U.S. Women's National Team as well. But when mm -hmm. we talk about major tournaments, you look at her, and this is Stephen Goff had a great article about this in the Washington Post. Look at the last 15 games in, in major tournaments. Two goals. Two goals. Mm -hmm. So you leave a player like, uh, like um, Ashley Hatch at home so you don't have another natural striker. You're more now relying on veteran players like you did Megan Rapino, etc. at the World Cup instead of bringing in the next generation, letting these kids mm -hmm. flourish. Because you do have a good base, an exciting base, but you need to let these kids play. I don't know if you saw the explanation from our good friends at U.S. Soccer as to why this was the first time that we were seeing I the did. official uh, with the national team. Because official for me was definitely the standout uh, of the second game of the international window. Apparently, playing at Tigres, even if you're scoring 35, 40 goals, whatever she scored, uh, is not at the level to be considered for the national team, which is super interesting, Herc, because we know... The national team was looking at players who were in college, players who were who in high school, players who were not playing professionally at all. And by the way, in some of those instances, Alyssa Thompson High School, Julia is not playing at all. They weren't just looking at the players, Herc. They weren't just kicking the tires on those players. They took them to the World Cup. They didn't even kick the tires on a player like Mia Fischel. Because why? Because they disrespected the level of Liga Mekis Femenil. That's a mistake. We now see the type of player she is. She didn't just turn into that player after... Uh, what is it, uh, three games at Chelsea, three games at Chelsea. She's been that player. And who knows her? We saw what the U.S. had problems with at the World Cup. You don't think Mia official could have helped? Of course. Any one of those players who played to, who played in this game could have helped. And that's, that's the part that frustrates one because I remember the Olympics. I remember the showcase. I remember the players. I remember them trouting out the tour afterwards. And, and right before the World Cup, these players aren't playing. The younger players didn't have that experience. So when they get to the World Cup, what do you think is going to happen? How do you think they're going to respond or react? You got to let these kids play. They can be of worth, and Mia Fischel is one of them. Yeah. The big question is, is there enough time, and are there enough spots on that Olympic roster to really see a generational overhaul? We know at the Olympics, it's usually only 18 spots. It's fewer than the World Cup, and there's not a lot of time, Herc. That's why you usually don't see a lot of turnover from a team at the World Cup to a team at the Olympics. Of course, now with a new manager and coming off the worst World Cup ever for the U.S., you That's figure the thing, we the will manager. see some of that?